I think maybe next Saturday I'll cook it because next Monday, Tuesday, I'm going to be offline. So why not? Why not go live on Saturday and cook it? I'm going to talk to Flesh Mother to see if she can help me. We can figure out which of the recipes we're going to make. The thing is, I think I might only do half a port, like only two instead of the four, because I have an induction stove and I'll be cooking at my stream setup. So I'm a little bit nervous. I don't want to burn everything down. I've never cooked on stream before. Ah, I think the breakfast is just for the USA, Chester, because I didn't get an offer for breakfast. I'm sorry. This is what happens when I have like a 70% USA audience, but I'm not in the USA. Am I Henya levels of cooking? Well, considering that Henya doesn't own a knife, doesn't boil her water, doesn't make her own kind of sandwiches. No, I'm definitely a better cook than Henya. I I used to, you know, I lived alone for a very, very, very long time and I've cooked. Yeah, Henya doesn't have a knife. She says her mother doesn't trust her with a knife. Oh, you know what I do when I cook? Apparently, this is extremely um, Caucasian of me. I, uh, so I, I had some friends over this summer and I was cooking and uh, I was using garlic butter to cook. And while I was cutting my veggies to cook, I would cut the garlic butter and I would just eat little chunks of the garlic butter. <laughs> and and my, my friends would look at me shocked, eyes like wide. Does nobody just eat butter? <laughs> yeah, straight butter. I'm a butter eater. Especially garlic butter. You've never like, when you open a tub of butter or margar margarine, you never like take a little spoonful of it. Not a lot, but like a little bit and eat it. This explains a lot. Like I would, I would slice the butter like you slice cheese, you know? And I would eat a little bit of, of the butter. I would, I would slice the butter like I slice cheese, but very thin. <laughs> it's so good it's so good every time i cook with garlic butter i have to i have to like eat a little bit of the garlic butter every every time oh i love it i love it please next time you're cooking with butter think of me <laughs> next time you got a little stick of butter and you're cutting little chunks of it for your food think of me think of me i'm just saying i'm just saying consider me Pick me. Choose me. I I have to tell this. I Wait, Ayuki. I don't know if Ayuki's lurking. Because Ayuki would be so proud of me if they're lurking. Ayuki, if you are lurking in the stream, can I get a Hoya? Can I get an Amen? And and, and if Ayuki's not lurking, I'm gonna say it anyway. I um I I I was I was I, 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 I was talking with um somebody in Vishojo that I admire very much and I was like I'm gonna be in Japan we 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 should get a drink and 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 she said and she said you're you're coming over to my house and we're drinking <laughs> <laughs> oh my god it's happening it's happening oh uh -huh. I'm blushing. So I'm, I'm gonna get case on a really fancy alcohol when I come when I come to Japan. A really fancy Canadian alcohol. <laughs> I'm going to the boss's house. <laughs> the boss's house. I'm excited. Be careful, you might have to kiss. <laughs> no, no kisses, just drinking. <laughs> Unless. But yeah, I just, uh, I feel like Ayuki would really appreciate this. So I Ayuki will find out when, when, when she finds out it's him. Hajim. I just said it's the boss. <laughs> you know what, Henya? Maybe I don't need, maybe I don't need your visa, Henya. <laughs> it's okay. I'm touchy feely too. Oh my goodness. I, it's going to be such a good, it's going to be such a good time. It's always a fun time, isn't it? Isn't it a fun time? I'm going to be going to Japan all... I think I'm... Okay. But I, I'm already kind of thinking of moving either to Japan or to the States. 
for the next like just a few years. And um, I think next year, sorry, this year, I think I'm going to Japan three times. It's a really long flight there and back. You know, th this could be solved if I just lived there. <laughs> But then the problem is if I move to Japan, it's going to be really hard for me to go to American conventions, right? American or European conventions are basically like, forget it. This is more for 2025, this stuff. So no worries. This is this is not anytime soon. I have a very big project that I'm working on. Okay. Secrets. I have one big project that I'm working on this year. Until that project is done, I, I'm not thinking about moving or anything. Honestly, Chris, I think it's for... Okay, I have I have a confession. I may be a little bit of a weeb. So I think it's always been that kind of exciting dream to live in Japan and do content there and have pals there. It's a lot easier. Like, I have so many friends that live in Japan that it would be really easy to hang out with a lot of people that I know. I know in Japan it's hard to make friends, but I already am a content creator who knows folks, right? And it just feels like something that would be harder to do in 10 years, right? In 15 years and 20 years, if I'm still alive, it just won't be the same. It'll feel more lonely. It's going to be harder. Plus, my stream time fits for Japan as well. Uh, I think I'll have to be waking up at 8 a.m. It's really easy, fun content. There's a lot of ideas. There's a lot of pals. There's, you know... um, and eventually, too, like I've, I've been wanting to do a podcast with somebody in person. And like, for example, Onigiri and I have really great banter. And, you know, if like it just it just makes sense. It just feels like there's a lot of content creators doing this kind of stuff there. A lot of my friends go to Japan a lot. And at the same time, America also works right. L.A. or Vegas could also work really well. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. Do I know Japanese? Oh, no. <laughs> I, I I will I will get um I, I will I will improve. Yeah, it's really fun. I think like finding smells. There's another problem with smells too. Is sometimes I like the way something smells, but I don't know if I should smell like that. Right? Does anybody know that? So I very much love floral, kind of light scents. But if I show up somewhere and I'm very tall and I'm wearing like leather and I talk very deep and all that stuff, then I don't know if I should really smell light. I feel like I naturally should smell a little bit more kind of domineering. I don't know. <laughs> I apply on both lock. I just spray. And then I also have this idea that if I'm going out in the day, I want a lighter scent than if I go out at night, you know? I definitely feel like I should smell like an apex predator. Yeah, I want to smell like a spider weaving a web, you know, and not like a dainty little flower. <laughs> but at the same time, maybe maybe it's it's time to smell like roses, you know, wake up and smell like roses. I want to play Monster Hunter World. I've never played Monster Hunter. Is it hard? I OK, I know it's hard, but I want to play it. I really want to play it. I'm gonna talk to Zen about maybe playing it next week with her. Maybe I'll maybe I'll go live a little bit earlier. I would steal Giga, but Giga, I think Giga is just just she's she's a GTA or she's a GTA V streamer for a little bit. She's in her Grand Theft Auto era. Is she a good guy? Is she a bad guy in GTA? What what's the lore? What, what does she do? Who's Gigi Gambino? Is she a good guy? Is she a bad guy? I know she's a little guy. She's a guy. She might join a gang, a good gang, right? Like a fun little group. Like, look, if you think about it, Vishojo's a gang, right? We're a gang of hooligans together, you know? She's an opportunist. I mean, I mean, you know, when, when you're small like that, you got to claw, you got to claw everything you can. You too would be an opportunist if you were four foot eight, you know? If you were a mid boss, come on, come on. What is the Vishojo gang sign? A V. <laughs> Is that the one judge freak that um, Z uh, I almost said Zint Zintreya. Zintreya is playing? She steals cars. That's pretty punk rock. Grandmaster, thank you for the bits. Arigato. Hold on. Arigato, arigato. Daiyo. Beats daiyo. Wait. Ah, arigato, arigato, daiyo. Beats daiyo. Hi. Arigato. Honto ni arigato. Beats arigato daiyo. 
I don't think I have her cadence at all. Oh, Pichu da yo? No, I don't. I don't sound like her at all. I don't think I sound like her. Ugh. Eh? No, no, no. Chat, no. I, I don't know how. I, I have to. I listen to her a lot, but I don't have her cadence down at all. At all, at all, at all. 